When you get embed code from YouTube for a specific video, it looks something like this. So you've got www.youtube.com slash embed slash, and then the ID for an individual video. And then I've got this question mark rel equals zero here. That means at the end of the video, nothing is going to play at the end of that video uh, as far as related videos. That's going to turn off all related videos at the end. So I can show you an example of that. That's when I've put that code in, it creates this video, and then at the end of the video, no related videos show at the end of the video. But there are a ton of other things that you can do uh, from within this little embed code, and one of the things that you can do is actually add a list type. So here's the code for embedding a list type, and there are three different kinds of list types. Maybe there will be even more in the future, but for right now, after that list type equals, you can put in three different options. So you could put in a playlist, you could put in a search, or you could put in user uploads. Behind this, then, you are going to have an additional piece of code and list equals. And that's going to go with all three of these different types of searches or different types of requests to YouTube. And what you would do here for search, what you do for the playlist is you would identify the playlist ID. And if someone has already put together a playlist, all you have to do is look in the web address and you'll get a playlist ID. Search is simply a search query. So let's say you wanted to find videos about joy. Well, all you would do is put that in and then Google or YouTube is going to pull into your playlist, pull into your embedded player videos about joy. And if you wanted user uploads from a specific user, then you would put in that user's username. In my case, that's Strive for Impact. So now let's see an example of how that looks. I still have this other video that I had here at the beginning of the video, but now what I'm going to do instead is have a list type of search, and the list that we are going to look for, or the search query that we're going to look for, is joy. And we're going to go ahead and update this. And now when I refresh this page, you can see it's loading a playlist about things related to whatever search query I did. And here's the first one that comes up, joy touch by touch. I'm not sure what that is. Looks like German Schlager music, actually. Random. But then in the playlist, we can see that these are related to joy. Kid President Challenge spread spread joy. So that would be if you wanted to put in a search query. If you wanted to do one for a user, you would change the list type to user uploads, and then you would choose the username of the person or the channel that you want to put in there. In this case, this is my channel, so I'm going to go over my username. So you want to put in the username of whatever user you want. And then I will go ahead and update this. And now when I go here, instead of having a playlist about joy, it's going to have the most recent videos that I've put up from my channel. So you can see here are the most recent uploads from Strive for Impact. And that is how you embed playlists or all videos from a specific user in an embedded YouTube video. My name is Jonathan Kraft. I made all of these YouTube videos about how to do things with YouTube videos on a web page. So go check them out. They are very interesting. And if you watch even half of them, You'll know more about embedding YouTube videos on web pages than anybody. Well, anybody who hasn't watched these videos. Enjoy! Seriously, check one of them out. I'll just, I'll just wait here. Really, they're, they're just right below. I'm just holding up my camera. Uh, seriously, just click on one of them. Any of them. Really, pick one. They're all clickable. Just pick one. Any of them. I'll just hang out. It's cool. I don't mind. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos almost every single day. If you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.